So I just watched a new a news piece. It was about this daycare in Saskatoon, Saskatchewan, Canada. And they would let their kids go out for recess, no matter how cold it was. As a matter of fact, they were talking about how there was one day last winter that they let their kids go outside, even though it was minus 49 degrees Celsius, which is probably somewhere in the minus 50 degree Fahrenheit range. To me, that's way too cold to be letting kids go outside for recess. Like, I understand, fine. Kids, um, you know, if they have to walk to or from school with parental supervision in those kind of temperatures, as long as they're not walking for too long and as long as they have adult supervision, you know, what can you do? But having them go outside for recess when it's that cold, no. They should be calling indoor recess. As a matter of fact, I don't think kids should be allowed to go outside for outdoor recess if the temperature is below minus 15 degrees Celsius, which is approximately 3 degrees Fahrenheit. Like whether that's the actual air temperature or whether that's the temperature including wind chill, they should not be going outside for recess if it's below minus 15 degrees Celsius. Like, to me, that's that's too cold. And yes, there are some parents, there are some kids that will be dressed properly for that, that, for that, that it's no problem. But then you get other kids that either A, they, their parents will send them off to school not really properly dressed for that kind of weather. And that could be for a variety of reasons, including financial reasons, well, like, like such as they can't afford better um, winter clothes. And B, even if they do have the proper clothes, you know how kids are. They might not dress themselves properly. They might lose their gloves or lose their hat or whatever. But yeah, the same way they won't let kids go outside for recess if it's raining... I don't think they should be letting them go outside for recess if it's extremely cold. And I don't think they should be, and for that matter, if it's extremely hot, I would say if the temperature is more than about, I would say if the temperature is above 32 degrees Celsius, whether that's actual air or 90 Fahrenheit, whether that's actually actual air temperature or um, or with humidity. Because again, that's unsafe. You know, you could end up getting kids with heat stroke and that kind of thing. I, I'm not a parent myself, but in my opinion, it's child abuse. If you let kids go out for recess in extreme weather conditions, to me, that's, that's child abuse. And these schools need to do better. I know if I had kids at that school, I would be extremely angry, and I would go down there and make it very clear to them, you better not have my kid going outside in those kind of extreme conditions. I don't know. Some of these teachers and some of these daycare instructors are just idiots and just don't care, and just should not be in a profession where they're responsible for kids. It's just like, um, I remember being in school, and teachers sometimes telling students, well, no, you're not allowed to go to the washroom during class. Like, you'd have to raise your hand to, to go to the washroom, and they'd say no. To me, that's BS. They should not be denying kids the right to go to the washroom. Going to the washroom is a right not a privilege. Or if kids are thirsty and want to go to the water fountain, to me, again, that's a right, not a privilege. I don't know. Some of these, t some of these teachers and daycare um, instructors are just completely, totally unfit for their job. And to me, some of them are child abusers. And if you don't think that this is child abuse, um, straight up, 
you're a freaking idiot and you don't deserve to be a parent.